England's final warm-up match was against Japan. It was 2-1 to England, courtesy of two own goals from Japan. Mark, what were your thoughts on the game yesterday? Um, it was a very strange game, actually. I mean, I think there's a lot of perhaps a bit of nervousness in that England side getting so close to the announcement of the squad, yeah. which uh, Capello's got to do this week. Um, yeah, there's a few players playing who won't be in that kind of final final, thir uh, final 23, if you ask me. And I think nerves kind of showed in a way. It took them a long time to get into the game. Who stood out for you yesterday? Was there key players? Um, because it was... By judging by the performance, yeah, wasn't I mean, the best, was it? The first half was poor, and then at half-time, he kind of changed things around a little bit, and I think the two men who came on and made a difference would have been Joe Cole and Stephen Gerrard, yeah. who really kind of drove the midfield on, and it was no coincidence, really, that their first goal came from across from, from Joe Cole, and I think those two players, to me, are kind of key to what England do. I mean, we all know about Wayne Rooney, yeah. and we know kind of what qualities he brings to the side but if you have players around him the likes of Gerrard and Cole who can create things then that's where England are going to succeed. It was an unconvincing win if you were an England fan would you be worried heading um, into the World Cup? I wouldn't be confident of winning it yeah. uh, I think they I don't know I don't think they're a little bit short in in certain areas um, they've no doubt they've got quality in individual players but they never seem to get together as, as a team and yeah. gel as a unit um, so in short no I wouldn't be confident they're going to win the World Cup but they've got a good chance as anybody and uh, that's, as I say, that team that played yesterday will not yeah. be anything like the team that plays the, the first match against the USA. Do you think there'll be any surprises in Capello's final? Uh, no, I don't think so. I think the kind of the seven who are going to miss out are pretty pretty established now. You look at the likes of Scott Parker, Stephen Warnock and Michael Dawson didn't, yeah. didn't play in these in these World Games. That's then ruled out for me. Um, I think Michael Carrick hasn't done enough. Yeah. It's a shame, but I think Darren Bent is going to miss out as well, um, so that's five. And uh, I think people like Tom Huddleston, again, hasn't quite quite worked out for him. So uh, I think he's probably got his squad sorted now. And, um, yeah, kind of obviously on to the finals now. Yeah.